And tonight we're learning some gun owners here in Southwest Florida approve of le legislation restricting those bump stocks. Four in your corners, Jasmine Miner spent the day at the gun show and least at the Lee Civic Center. She's explaining what people there had to say about the proposed regulations. A typical gun owner wants one thing to protect themselves, protect yourself and your family. They want to protect themselves and the best way they feel possible is to buying arming themselves, buying handguns. It's that protection that inspires single father David Young to buy a pistol at the Lee County Gun Show. He tells me his 12 year old daughter is the most important thing to him. For somebody to do harm against a child, it's the ultimate assault on innocence. And that's one of the main reasons why I, I do have a concealed weapon and uh, why I feel I need to be armed uh, is to protect my daughter. But guns are now under the microscope after the horrific shooting in Las Vegas. Stephen Paddock shot and killed 58 people and hurt more than 500 others. And investigators say Paddock used a bump stock to turn his semi-automatic weapons into automatic ones. Now the NRA is calling for a review on bump stocks. Young says that doesn't bother him as long as it doesn't get in the way of keeping his family safe. I personally don't think you need an automatic weapon. I mean, it's, they're designed only to kill. Um, I would have no problem with having a ban on that specific accessory, just as long as it doesn't snowball into other legislation. Young went through the entire process, asking the experts questions, filling out a background form, and 35 minutes later, he walked out with his new pistol with no worries about changes in gun legislation. Well, there's a Republican Congress and Senate and Republican president, so chances are slim to none that uh, it'll change in any great form. And for those wanting stronger gun law restrictions, gun vendors want them to know they care. Don't think that just because we're here hanging out with a bunch of guns, that we're care we don't care, you know, that we don't care. We do. I can promise you that every each and every one of these people here you know, are here with heavy hearts and care. Jazz and Miner, Fox 4 in your corner. The gun show at the Lee County Civic Center continues tomorrow from 10 to 5. And if you decide to go, there's a concealed weapons permit class, which will go over everything from safety to background checks.